Welcome back, my beautiful Tri-State area. This is Zen Sam's, your favorite iHeartRadio host from 710 WOR, the voice of New York iHeartRadio. And today, I'm all the way in Nashville, Tennessee, covering Music Scale 2024. And I have bumped into my dear friend, Dr. Sarania Wiles of the Mayo Clinic. Welcome, my friend. Nice to see you again. Nice to see you, too. And this is so fitting because this is, of course, Experts on the Microphone series, a going deep segment. So... Talk to me about what you have noticed. What trends have you seen this year at Scale Music City 2024 in regenerative medicine? So Scale Music City this year is going beyond regenerative medicine. I think we've started with regenerative aesthetics where we're getting exposed to things like exosomes and stem cells and going beyond with new, new, new trends that are coming. But we're also highlighting longevity science, which I think is really unique and cutting edge. This really focuses on root cause, targeting the wellness, holistic wellness, functional aesthetics. So those are the trends that we're seeing this year. And that's exactly your area of expertise. What is, uh, in your opinion, and we're going to shift gears a little bit, in Q, Q3 of 2023, the number three Google search was carboxytherapy. Women and men were searching what this new innovative way of rejuvenating the skin truly meant. I know that the dermatological community is using it both pre and post care. Uh, I'm aware that it's been around since the 1930s, although the method of delivery has changed. Can you fast forward, give us the, the lowdown on what CO2 lift is and, and how practitioners are using it in their practice pre and post care? Absolutely, and I'm excited to share that at Mayo Clinic, we're running the CO2 lift carboxytherapy study where we're doing a CO2 laser on patients and then following it up before and after procedure with a CO2 lift mask. This is a really unique therapy that is topical carboxylation. So that allows more oxygen flow to the area post-procedure and helps with healing of the skin post-procedure. So we're studying these in very unique ways. We're collecting skin biopsies, the skin microbiome. So how is it going beyond uh, the skin improvement that we're seeing visibly, but at the lower level of affecting molecular change, cellular change? So those are the results that we'll have out to you by the end of the year. That's fascinating. Now, the delivery system for CO2 lift, can you talk to me about that? Yes, so CO2 lift is a topical delivery system that kind of uh, allows the coming together of two chemicals that creates a reaction of topical carboxytherapy. So it's a, it creates an oxygen dissociation curve shift. What does that mean? Fancy word for saying that it allows more oxygen flow to the skin. And you want more oxygen flow during the time of healing so that you can get the right nutrients, the right uh, factors that are locally available for healing. Wow, I've learned so much today. Every time I speak to you or follow your page, I learn something because you're always just at the at the forefront of the latest in technology and research. Thank you so much for chatting with us today. Thank you so much. I'm here with Dr. Ted Lane of Sonova Dermatology, and we're chatting the latest in skincare trends, what he's seeing here at Scale Music City 2024, and his take on what carboxy therapy for the skin truly is all about. Nice to have you on. Thank you. I'm so happy to be here. Okay, talk to me about what your specialty is at Sonova. Yeah, so I do a lot of research. I'm the, the chief director of research at Sonova, but I also am very involved in our skincare as well. And uh, we really do use the carboxy therapy mask, quite frankly, post procedure. So we really do believe that it increases oxygen penetration through the epidermis, and that therefore it hastens wound healing. So carboxy therapy is something that we absolutely utilize in almost all of our locations. I love that it's trending. A lot of people are trying to Google search this to see what this is all about. Can you talk to me about where carbon dioxide therapy was created and how it came about? Oh gosh, I, I don't know how it came about. It started in the 1930s and has been, it has evolved since then. Initially used as an injectable carbon dioxide, but now we use it as a mask, which obviously is so much more user friendly. Uh, and it allows us to utilize it really quickly post procedure with our estheticians and laser techs doing it versus uh, one of our providers needing to inject it. So full of knowledge. I love it when I speak to experts, hence expert on the microphone. Okay, so talk to me. We're going to shift gears a little bit about what you've seen trending this year at 
Scale Music City 2024? I mean, Scale is great because it keeps us right on the cutting edge of skincare. And I think that what's trending right now is all about exosomes and regenerative dermatology and medicine in general. We're stopping to, to just think about how do we, you know, repair the barrier and increase moisturization and hydration. And we're really starting to think about how do we stop and reverse aging at the cellular level, at the DNA level. Uh, and, and that's kind of at the very the tip of the spear for skincare right now. Tell me what's no longer in style. Well, you know, what's old is new again, really. So hyaluronic acid, which was something that we had kind of forgotten about, is now really coming back. There's a huge resurgence about hyaluronic acid, as there should be. It's a wonderful molecule, acts as a humectant to draw water into the skin. I think what we have kind of really stopped talking about is DNA repair, which I think is going to come back again. So what's old is new right now, and then at the next frontier is regenerative medicine, like I talked about. And less is more. People are oh, no yeah. longer wanting overdone lips. They're not They're not looking for the cat eye look that looks unnatural. I think women and men are looking for something that's a, a everlasting, natural, beautiful look, treating the skin from within. In terms of skincare, it, it's, you're right. It's about looking natural. We used to think about K-beauty, which was like 10 steps in the morning, 10 steps at night. We're really trying to pull that back now to be more realistic and more economical with three or four steps at most in the morning and the same at night. Wow. Well, there you go. Expert on the microphone right here at Scale Music City 2024. I seem to find all of them. Thank you so much for coming on today and chatting with us. It was yeah, a pleasure. Thank you. It's my pleasure. A Moment of Zen is brought to you by CO2 Lift. As we age, our skin loses moisture and elasticity, causing wrinkled skin. You can reverse this aging process with CO2 Lift. CO2 Lift utilizes the powerful benefits of carbon dioxide to lift, tighten, and regenerate your skin. This simple, painless at home carboxy therapy treatment is scientifically proven to reverse the aging process. You will see reduction in wrinkles, increase in luminosity, and improve pigmentation, sagging, skin tone, and radiance. For more information or to order CO2 Lift, go to CO2Lift. Lift.com.